Hey everybody, hope you're good. So, so in today's video, I wanted to try soap brows. I got this from Essence. I actually have a few other Essence brow products I also wanted to try. I have three in total. I don't know if I'm, if I'm going to be able to um, fit them in, but I will see. We're going to see how we finish this. So I was going to try soap brows, but I've always been a bit intimidated. Oh, by the way, hi, my name is Abby. <laughs> I'm really around here. And if you're not new, thank you for coming back to watch another video. So, as I was saying, um, I've always been intimidated by soap brows. They kind of look a bit, I don't know, a bit scary, like really spidery looking, or at least what I've seen on YouTube. Like people just brush them up and brows come out of nowhere and then they're just left there, like just laminated, <laughs> standing up. There's something really, I don't know. Um, off about that like I'm not used to having my brows like standing up on the ends like they're you know waiting for assignment so I might do mine differently but I do want to see what the fuss is about um, and I saw that Essence had this brow um, the salt brow and it's really cute as well I think this might be a limited edition packaging I feel like it might be maybe maybe cancer research related I don't know because it's got this hashtag pink and proud I got it off one of my favorite websites to shop when it comes to like beauty or basically beauty products um it is just my look.com and they this isn't sponsored of course but they what i loved about them when i first uh when i first discovered them was that they do free shipping free shipping in the uk regardless of what you buy so you can basically buy one thing and you get free shipping which is you know uh, really really good you get i think it's like second class shipping so this essence strong um this essence salt brow styler is what i'm going to be trying um i've seen a few salt brow videos so i do know you you're supposed to wet the spoolie that you're going to use to get you know the soap product out but what i like is the fact that this is portable so i can obviously take it around and I, and I also like the fact that it's cheap it's really really affordable i think this might have been like three pounds i think nearly all these brow products um i've got were about three pounds four pounds it can't be more than that because it's essence um yeah so this salt brow comes with its, its own little spoolie so you can see here so it's pink and proud and inside okay so it's not fragrance which is good i just i never yeah i think another thing i didn't like about like soap brows was the fact that you had to have this whole bar of soap like who's carrying soap around to do their brows especially in the morning when i'm trying to get dressed for work i don't have time to be getting soap getting water spoolie brow then i apply my brow products like no one's got time for that so i like the fact that this is portable and i hope it's a quick process to do my brows so let's see and i hope it also lasts as well because i've already filmed a brow product i've already filmed a brow tutorial on my channel and my brow routine is basically uh, two products i have a brow pencil and a brow sealant and it makes my brows last all day and the brow pencil is dual ended so it has the pencil and it has the spoolie on the end which is like my perfect combination so this is like an extra step <laughs> but let's see anyway i mean i'm just you know trying to discover some new brow products that are affordable and hopefully good so the other three brow products i got from essence are the brow pomade plus brush this is what color is this this is in the color four and it says it's long lasting smudge proof and waterproof which would be great for like holidays or swimming so this is what it looks like it has a slanted brow brush and the brow pomade is in the container which is grey so you don't need um, an extra thing like an extra tool which is great this will be good for those who already have maybe like four brows and they just need a bit of filling in because for me I need I always want to have a spoolie to disperse the products but my brows are sparse and this is I feel like this might be as good as, as, as they're going to get my brows have been thinner than this and I've been trying to grow them out and this is far this is as far as I've gotten so uh yeah this would be good for those who have maybe like four brows but I do like the fact that it's portable again so i can possibly use this with another product 
and that will be everything I need without it being like a you know a pop like a dip brow you know like the Anastasia dip brow and then you need a special brush for it and then you need a spoolie then you need another thing so like I like the fact that they're a pen um they're like you can hold them in your hands and chop them in your um what do you call it in your uh makeup bag so that's one the next one is the essence super last 24 hour eyebrow pomade pencil which is waterproof and it says it's twistable 24 hour lasting and waterproof um with with sharpener and brush where's the sharpener there's no sharpener in here i don't know what that's about but this is in the shade cool brown 40. and it has uh, a twistable let's just see how much product is in here i mean you get a decent amount this is a lot more than some of these other higher end brow pencils and you get this little um oh that's what it is oh my gosh i've just discovered something this is so cool oh my goodness this is really really smart wait is that supposed to happen wait that's not supposed to happen is that supposed to happen oh oh it is oh my gosh right so anyway <laughs> right that's where the sharpener is okay so this end bit has a lid and like a, a brush and then I accidentally pulled this up that's what the sharpener is so this sharp shop this thing that comes off is meant to sharpen that oh it does sharpen oh that's so cool so I'm really easily pleased. I haven't lived yet, so <laughs> all it takes is a three pound eyebrow pencil to get me excited. This is really nice. I, well, I like little surprises like that and I like smart product design. That's really cool. Um, so next I have the brow, the Essence Brow Powder and Define Pen. It says this double ended eyebrow pen, use of powder from the inner cap to fill sparse areas with the foam tip and the triangle and the triangle pen tip to draw precise lines and outlines okay so and this is in the shade for deep brown so this is the shape of eyebrow pencil like that I'm used to with the revolution draw brow Let's see how much product you get in here. Okay, so you don't get as much as the other, um, what do you call it? You get about, is that an inch or over an inch? Maybe over an inch of product. And then, Yeah, so, okay, so, you have the, I think you do have a brow powder in here, where am I? I think there might be some products in here in the lid, because this is covered in products, so it's either that or it's in the canister, in like the thing, in, you know, the container, and yeah, I feel like I've used, um, Revolution had a concealer, like a colour corrector that was like a punchy type of <laughs> motion. Um, yeah, so this, I think the product is in here, it's hard to tell. I think it must be in here or in here, one of the two. But yeah, there's a brow powder in here and then you can define your brows further with the pencil. Um, let me just swatch some of these, so... Let me just swatch them so you can see if the colors are different and I think they might be. So this is for deep brown. Okay, so the first one is the brow pomade in the shade four. They're all shade four, but the browns all look different to me. So this is the one we're gonna try first. Oh, it's quite uh, creamy. Okay, this 
could work. So that's the shade. I will compare it to my Revolution Dual Bow in dark brown, just so you can see what that looks like. This is the Super Last Eyebrow Pomade Pencil. Again, in shade 40 Cool Brown. So that's that. And then this is the Brow Powder and Define Pencil. Okay, so I feel like the Brow Define Pencil, which is here, is closer to what I'm looking for. These two are a bit too grey. This is very grey. And now let's see what the powder looks like. So the brow powder looks to be about the same colour, I think. That's the brow powder, that's the pencil in the same uh, product, in the same container. So I think this is probably the most promising, but um, actually, yeah, this still has a slight bit of grey, but this is the most grey. Yeah, this pencil, the one that I was really pleased with, is the most grey. Okay, so I've left it a few seconds just to see if these will dry down. Um, I've swatched against these two, the first two, which is the Brow Pomade Plus Brush and the pencil that blew my mind. Um, and they are both dry and transfer proof right now. The, what do you call it, the Brow Powder and Define Pencil um, they're still leaving a bit of residue on my hand so they're not quite drying down does it promise to be it doesn't promise to be like long lasting I guess so maybe it's not supposed to be yeah it's the only one that doesn't promise to be like waterproof or anything like that so anyway let's try this soap brow product so I've just had to bend it a bit just to make it easier to get some of the product out and it's quite stiff I'm always amazed at how brow has come out of nowhere <laughs> with this soap brow technique though I have to say And the thing I've never really known is whether or not salt brows are supposed to make your brows last longer or if, if they're just supposed to like keep them in shape as in are they supposed to make them transfer proof as well or are they just supposed to almost like just keep them in shape and laminate them up? That's what I want to know. See? This is what I think people forget to do. They just like brush it up and then forget to bring it back down again. I can never go out with like, actually it doesn't look so bad. I suppose maybe because I don't have such full brows, but I just feel like they need rounding off a little. Let me know what you think down in the comment section. So I think I will try, which one do I want to try? I'm gonna try, because I like this color the most, I'm gonna try the Brow Powder and Define pen. So use the powder from the inner cap to fill in sparse areas first. Okay. Yeah, do you know what? The, the product is in the canister because you can push it. So you basically have to use the back of your hands. I 
think. Or maybe it's not. I honestly don't know where this magical brow product is coming from. This is not bad. I think my tiny mind is being blown right now. All right, let me. this part here this isn't bad this is like the closest in terms of color to my brow hairs looking very very youthful at the moment <laughs> okay so that's one <clears throat> one down and then so that was the brow powder and define pen right next I'm going to try the essence the super last 24 hour eyebrow pomade pencil with the sharpener thingamabob making my brows look really really grey but I am loving how my brows suddenly look very natural and like naturally full but they're just this colour is just too grey too, too grey for me. I'm going to try the brow pomade and brush. Um, maybe this will add a bit more warmth. Back to my face. Back to my brows rather. I'm going to use the brow, the original, uh, the one I was using before, the brow powder and define pencil because that's less grey. And just use that. I think this might be as good as it gets, but I really, really like the result. Um, the colours are off for the brow pomade um, and the 
eyebrow pomade pencil the one with the sharpener but i will still use these i think what i what it is um they will add texture so i'll probably use them as a base because um what really gives you your your brow hair is that fluffy like 3d look isn't just the salt bar i think it's using different colored eyebrow pencils because they kind of look a bit more realistic like almost um it's almost like when you're painting and you're you when you add highlights in the form of these uh lighter colored like slightly gray tinted brow products they kind of have add a bit of highlight highlight to your uh brow hairs and then you can go in with your regular brow products so i'm just going to show you what my normal brow pencil looks like this is from revolution um makeup revolution and this is their dual brow it's got a thick nib just like the brow powder and define um pencil from essence this is revolution this is essence and i'm just going to put it next to the other so you can see it's a little bit darker and that's like the perfect color for so this is the revolution dual brow and this is the one that i prefer so i think what it is i'll use any of these brow products and i'll probably end up going over um, my brows but i think the only one that i can use with confidence on its own is the brow powder and define pencil which is probably the i didn't even think i would but yeah i didn't think i'd like this as much but it's the closest in terms of its um the hue it's like a cool tone brown and it gives me the option of two different types of products as well so i quite like that i really wanted to like this the most because you know it's a pencil with a brush and a little sharpener as well so it's really cool but it's just the colors a bit off um i could see if there's like a deeper color a deeper brown but i think this was the best match according to what i could see online but i really like the fact that my brows look really natural and i think i've kind of managed to make them look even as well so yay so those are the brow products i've tried from essence leave a comment down below and let me know what you think in terms of the colors or how the brows look and whether or not you'll be trying them like i said i got these all these products from justmylook.com and they have um free shipping like on anything like there is no minimum which i've never heard of a lot of the other websites that i love like feelunique.com lookfantastic.com obviously beauty bay as well um super drug boots they all have like a minimum shipping but just my look don't which is great so if you ever wanted to try like an essence product they have, have a lot of essence products on their website catrice um makeup revolution is also on there now which is great but yeah so they have a bunch of different um brands on their site that you can try not just makeup skincare as well so yeah try them out and let me know if you know about them and if you've ever bought anything from them as well so their shipping isn't like um uh, their shipping is great it's like i think it takes less than a week to arrive like maybe four or five days because it's second class shipping but because it's free i honestly don't mind so yeah so that's it hope you like this video if you, if you do please do give me a thumbs up that really does help my channel out um if you want to subscribe please do hit the notification bell while you're doing that so you get notified when i next upload so until next time stay blessed have a great morning afternoon evening or night wherever you are and me and my brows will see you in my next video we'll catch you later bye